Welcome to the weekly Prepper Pantry Hall from the Cold War Prepper. My name is Lee, and uh, this is the weekly Prepper Pantry Hall for the week ending Saturday, July 13th, 2024. I told you uh, that I had put in my Thrive Life order early on the 1st, and I anticipated that it would probably arrive as soon as I did last week's Pantry Hall video, and sure enough, it did. A couple hours after completing that video, uh, it arrived, so we'll show it here today. Uh, let's get into what we've got here. So one of the things I think is going to be important is having uh, instant refried beans. Uh, I have a whole bunch of that from the LDS, the, the Provident Living Center, but they've discontinued doing that, so I still want to add more. Uh, this is very good. Add with it a little bit of freeze-dried onion or dehydrated onion, uh, freeze-dried cheese, and then make yourself a tortilla with the flour. You've got one heck of a meal with a bean burrito. Uh, I also got in two jars of... Uh, Savoy's roux. Now these are really great. You've got about 60 servings of roux. Uh, you aren't going to spend a whole bunch of fuel or energy trying to make your own roux. Uh, it's not quite as good as make your own, but I tell you what, uh, you're going to save an awful lot of uh, energy uh, if you use a pre-made roux. Remember, making a roux is going to take a couple hours. So uh, these are 60 servings per jar, two jars, 120 servings. Disadvantage, refrigerate after opening. So if you don't have a way to refrigerate um, your open jar of roux after you use it, uh, probably not the best thing for you. I also have some Tony Chachery's, I believe it is, um, powdered uh, roux. So you can get that instead. I think I have a, a, a jar of that coming from Walmart. Uh, that should be in next week's order. Just one can of apple pie filling. Uh, that's going to be important for apple cobbler. Uh, we've got in one j large jar of chicken bouillon. I did not realize I did not have any big jars of chicken bouillon. I did the uh, bouillon video the other day and did an inventory of everything and said, you know, I need more bouillon, chicken bouillon. So this will take me up equal with my beef. Uh, then I also got the uh, tomato uh, with chicken flavor uh, from Noor. And then I got another vegetable from uh, Hereford. Her Her I'm sorry, Herbox. Uh, picked up some sun-dried tomatoes, and then for uh, Thrive Life, we got two cans of uh, tomatoes, one green beans and one peas. Those are on sale for the month of uh, July. I recommend those. Also got the uh, chicken slices. They're on sale for the month of July. And then raspberries. That's Helen's favorite fruit. I also got one of their uh, Southwestern South chicken. This is a dinner for three and just add water, basically. Um, we got in a through, this is on sale on Amazon, the through night um, flashlight for underneath your pew pew. And so I got that, that's marked down to about $17. So I figured, yeah, I need one. Uh, got in a box of Provodon iodine swab sticks. So this is for first aid kit, disinfecting, uh, keeping your wounds clean. Did get a pulley. Uh, I'm concerned about, I'm in an HOA, so uh, even though with my ham radio, I can't have a permanent uh, tower or mast up with the antenna on it. Uh, so I have to, you know, put it up and take it down on a regular basis. And I figured the more pulleys I can get, and then leverage that in raising and lowering the antenna field, that would be far, far better. Uh, so I'm going to try to keep on getting a, you know, a pulley every now and then. I figured they'd also be come in handy for some other uses, so we'll see what we do. Um, uh, right now is, is back to school time, or at least back to school um, equipment time, supplies time. So I picked up uh, a box of four by six uh, index cards several uh these were all 50 cents each by the way uh got in these were were at walmart the larger college rule notebooks these composition notebooks were at the grocery store picked up one of each color and i figure i can use that for whatever i need in an shtf environment i did order uh jody weiss tacy taylor and christina uh rios dorado's book which is meals and minutes and this is all using Thrive Life uh, components and meals that you can make just using Thrive Life. Uh, the last thing I did pick up were some uh, binder clips or spring clamps uh, from Harbor Freight. And uh, that, oh no, I did. I, I, I got one extended or larger 
antenna to replace the rubber ducky for my Yesu, my YA6. Uh, so that should give me a little bit better uh, communications with that. I'm also, a friend is giving me his uh, magnetic uh, antenna for the roof of the car. So that, that's going to extend that as well. So kind of excited about that. I just put out a video, a short on um, Amron, the American Readout Radio Operators Network. This is, we did a review on the book, the Radio Operators, um, what was it, the, I forget the name of the book. Uh, John Jacob Schmidt is the guy's name who started this. Uh, but this is basically, what are we going to do for emergency communications after Teotihuacan or the end of the world as we know it? And so I put that short out just now. We're going to have an exercise next weekend. Uh, I put in a link for the Texan PL880, which is the HF radio receiver that I use, um, and all kinds of information. So I recommend you see that. I'll, I'll put a link in for the American Radio, radio Operators Network, Amron, uh, in the descriptions down below. And uh, of course, if you want any of the Thrive Life components, I have been a distributor with Thrive Life since 2009 when they were called Shelf Reliance. So I've been a distributor now for about 15 years. Okay, so remember that we're all in this together so we can come out the other side together. Food, I think, is going to be critical. Stock up on your food supplies, whatever you can. Uh, once again, please be kind, polite, and respectful to each other because togetherness is how we'll all survive this together. Take care. Bye-bye.